Well, good morning. I hope you're doing well. We're back in Gold Wars 2, and we were supposed to be heading out somewhere, but it turns out I had a couple mails. So, apparently, there's something called Dragon Bash going on, and it says it wouldn't be a proper celebration without your attendance. Join me in Holbrook for another moot for the ages. There will be tests of strength, racing, food, song, and most importantly, ale. I'll see you there. Unless, of course, you don't enjoy fun. So, <laughs> let's see where that's at. Yeah, so it is a little bit somewhere near this waypoint, which means we've never even been there. We are not going to bother with that one. Though it sounds like fun. Alright, next one. It says, Novice, I'm so excited to meet you. You must have wonderful stories to tell. I can't wait to hear them. I've been assigned to escort you to the Dorman Priory, so meet me by the Black Line Trading Company headquarters in Wines Arch, and we'll get started on a grand adventure. All right, that is from Siren, and so we need to go to the Priory Archive. Sounds, sounds good. The last one says, Salutations, fellow genius. I observed you communicate with a cat in Lion's Arch and thought, there's a creative type who might appreciate a feline-oriented, small-scale golem companion. As it happens, I secured this construct from a raving mad inventor I had to do battle with while exploring in the fractals of the mists. Although it lacks softness, it also excels in being uncat-like where it really counts. It doesn't shed, consume food, or excrete waste. It answers to the name Professor Mew, Excelsior. Gizmaster Smith. And it says, note, this message was sent by another player. It was not sent by the Guild Wars 2 team. And they have sent me a mini Professor Mew. It says, oh my god, we gotta see this. We also have to come up with a very appropriate response. Oh, what, what should I say? First, let's see it. Okay. So this is the Fractal Gate Portal. I don't know. Oh, we have a key. But wait. All right. Use. <gasps> oh my god. It's a little mini robot. But it's got cat ears and a little nose and whiskers. <laughs> it's so cute. Hi. And your name is Professor Mew. Mini Professor Mew. <laughs> is it is it horrible that the the mini is almost <laughs> as dull as my character? <laughs> All right. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! That's adorable. Okay, we need to come up with a proper response because just thank you doesn't cut it, does it? Give me one moment. All right, so we have done some sort of a letter. I hope it's a worthy thank you. Let's read it. It says, I have received your communications and am now in the possession of one Mew 500 Gollum, going by the moniker of Professor Mew. The unit appears to be functional and will serve me nicely as a companion out in the field. I'm gratified you also elucidate it on the care requirements for Professor Mew. This will make the task of tending to him as effortless as if he were one of my favorite turrets. Excelsior, Catalysia, Priory, and Initiate. Well, it sounds silly, doesn't it? But hopefully it will work. So we will send that off. Mail has been sent successfully. And now, <laughs> now with that out of the way, let's see. We want it to head off to. Uh... Oh, that's right. We have to go talk to somebody in the Dorman Priory. So we need to go that way. Oh, that's right. And here he is. This is. Professor Mew. Come here, Professor. 
Thank you. No, come out here in the sunshine where everybody can see you. Thank you. There. Isn't he rather adorable? He's a little golem. I like the colors. Oh, and he meows. I mean, it's a robot version of a meow, but he meows. He's cute. Come, come, come. Thank you. We need to go. What's in here? Because that was something else. I had determined, finally determined that I needed, uh, I needed to start doing some crafting. That's what I had determined. And I can't remember, I think it's called Huntsman. But that would be the crafting profession that makes guns and stuff. Sorry, I, I totally forgot. I blanked out and totally forgot what I was saying. But yeah, no, I think it's Huntsman that I'm looking for. And it makes, like I said, the guns and stuff, which would be really useful for her. I keep coming back in here, so maybe who I'm talking need to talk to is in here. A mariner plaque. The site of Yom's Mercantile, established 1235 AE. Yom was the first merchant to set up shop in Lion's Arch. He transformed the city into the largest trading port in Tyria and served on the ship's council. Okay. Me. Travel to Priory Archive in Lion Arc, but there's something in here that keeps saying I need to be in here. Dredging up the past. Alright, this one is going to drive me nuts. I don't know what that was all about. Uh, Excelsior. Excelsior. I heard somebody say Excelsior. I don't know. I don't get it. Maybe it's on top. I doubt it. Wait. Right there. Uh, right there. Would I like to continue my story? Yes. <laughs> that only took me forever to find. Shame on me. All right. Okay, so in we go. Speak with Stuart Gix. You must be Stuart Gix. Hello. Hello. Excuse me, who are you? My name is Gix, and I'm the German Prairie Stuart. You'll be seeing a lot more of me, I promise you. Have a good day now. Ah, I see. Thank you for the information, Stuart. The Dermond Priory is a bastion of history, containing the collected wisdom of the ages. For 200 years, we've stood upon a foundation of lore, research, and exploration. When Lion's Arch was flooded by the rise of the Nation of Orr, our forebearers rescued the city's survivors. We salvaged knowledge that would otherwise have been lost. Now is the dragon's ravage ever greater expanses of Tyria. We must do even more. We must discover the truths that Tyria needs to survive. Where the dragons came from, why, and how to end their threat. The Priory is dedicated to learning. Siren. One of our most cunning scholars will provide tutelage to help you gain wisdom that you will need. Dermond, our founder, said it best. Your power is only equal to the sum of your knowledge. 
If that's true, then we're Tyria's best hope to survive the darkness gathering on the horizon. Welcome to the Dermond Priory. actually a pretty nice introduction pick your up your spear mount your war claw and journey to the isle of janthir to claim your homestead guild wars 2 janthir wells includes a fresh new story a new raid and other challenging encounters in a year of ongoing content updates no thank you um and you no so if i haven't bought end of dragons what Makes you think I would buy the next one. Now, where am I? Am I still in an instance? Yes, I am. Okay, I like the Dorman Priory. I think the first time I joined... I cannot remember the name of it right now. It'll be cherry. Ah! Here you are. You must be the new novice I was sent to retrieve. I'm a Magister of the Order, but we don't need to use titles. Just call me Siren. Happy to meet you. I'm looking forward to working with the Dermond Priory. It's nice to see that you're enthusiastic. I know I'm supposed to take you straight back to the Priory, but I'd like to take a little side trip. While I was waiting for you, Explorer Kecht was telling me this really interesting story about an old dwarven tomb. And guess what? It's right on our way. I'll still take you to meet Steward Gix at the main Priory building, but I want to have a bit of fun first. Magister Siren, you're not listening to me. We don't even know if the story is true. What if this tomb doesn't even exist? What if it's just a legend? Oh, Ket, stop being a spoil sport. If I ignore this, those skulky dredge might find the tomb first. And how would that turn out? They'd destroy it. Come on. It won't hurt anything to go look around a bit. The novice doesn't mind, right? Exploring an ancient tomb on my first day in the Order? Sounds fun. I don't mind at all. Then it's settled. I'll meet you at Molent Summit, novice. Don't keep me waiting, okay? Okay. She seems really nice. And you? You seem like a po spoil sport. Yeah, kecked. And it just seems like a really appropriate name for you. Ha <laughs> We get to go do some scoring right off the bat. I like that. Hey, where'd my golem go? Apparently I can't take my golem in. Excuse me? Apparently I can't take my golem into the instance. All right. So, before we do anything, we'll summon our little friend a little companion i guess we're not going that way well, aren't you fancy and fearly fiery looking yeah that's pretty fancy <laughs> that, that outfit is like just completely on fire I was gonna say it was straight fire, but that just sounded stupid, so I didn't. Which way are we going? I tell you what, that tourist is right about that giant glass dome. It looks beautiful, but I sure wouldn't want to be under it in the event of a earthquake or something. Where are we headed? Way, way over here. Oh, then we might see a couple of things I haven't seen yet on the way. Because unfortunately, I did intend to explore the place some more, but I never did get around to it. Whew, that's some lag. I'm not going to worry about well, the beast is right now. Huh. And 
Island, and we have discovered something. We're about to hit a waypoint. There we go. Should be another one up here somewhere. Now we should be turning off somewhere shortly. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? In here. There it is. Got that one. What are you? Directions. Okay. Well, unfortunately for you, I don't really need them right now. Line guard recruit. Nope, I'm not doing the line guard, thank you. Oh, isn't this... This is the uh, area that's got the... Hold on. One of the vistas is way, way, way on top of a lighthouse. And I remember doing that one. It was not fun. Not for me, anyway. That one was... The thing is, I know that this is a game that's pixels and everything, but there are a couple of instances where you get up high enough in a game world and it actually can trigger your fear of heights. And this was one of them. It was pretty bad. Hi. I mean, clearly we'll end up doing it again, but... <gasps> Hello, kitty. The cat isn't hungry right now. Aw. Kitty's not hungry. Kitties are never hungry. Mourner's Pass. Is this where we're headed? Okay. I wasn't expecting all that. Get my little golem buddy out. Search the cave for dwarven relics. So first we have to find the cave. Where is this cave we're looking for? Can we go down this way? New event nearby. Are we serious? No. <laughs> Let's stay up here. Oh, there's a lot of somebody down here doing it. What the heck is it? Everyone. Oh, so this is the dragon bashing. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Was not expecting that. Oh, look. I like your wings. Uh, your, your, your mouth's wings are nice, too, but I like your wings. They look like stained glass. Now this location we... looks new. Yeah, it... I love it. This location looks new. Well, you've never been here before, and your location is all the way over here. Okay. And we have a waypoint over this way. We should probably stop there. We can figure out where there is. Okay, 
it's up, up, up. Okay. A fur fly. Oh, that sounds absolutely lovely. <laughs> All right. Hi. I guess I should talk to you. Over in Bouldermouth Vale, Herder Lyot's been having trouble maintaining her doliac ranch. A group of local ice worms developed a taste for her doliacs, and Lyot's caught between fending off the worms and tending to her animals. If you have time, stop by and lend her a hand. Okay. I guess we should run across and see what this is. The Priory Bridge. Oh, is that the Priory up there? Well, then you now have to go be nosy. Sylvan Hound. Well, oh, you're a shiny one. Anima! Don't mind me, I'm just being nosy about everything. Bunch of white moes up here. We have discovered the Dorman Priory. We might as well get the waypoint here, because if this is the Priory, we're probably going to be here more than once. Yeah, it's definitely a very shiny wolf. I never noticed that about uh, my Silvari's wolf. It probably was very shiny too. A, a sewer gate access. The door is closely guarded. Speak to the guard to enter. Excuse me. This area is under construction. Check in later. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Priory historian. Oh. And if I hadn't been nosy, I would have missed that. So, let's go get it. How do I get over there? Woo! -hoo. Woo! Um. Uh. There we go. Like that. Here I thought that we were just gonna go from quest to quest, and all of a sudden, boom! Here, here. Go explore this place. I'm like, okay, I can do that. we go. Boop. Actually, that didn't hurt nearly as much as I feared it would. Oh, it was going to be painful. It wasn't. So, I guess we should stop being nosy now. No, we shouldn't, because I gotta go see what that is. Oh, wow. Yeah, Catalystia would definitely be right at home here. We made the right choice. Part of the Priory. Hero Challenge. The magically suspended tablets contain the amassed knowledge of the Priory. Surging with power, the tablet's inscription emit a faint glow while they rotate around a central pillar of light. Commune with the place of power. And... Hero challenge complete. Although that wasn't very much commun communing as it was... A very stressful commune. I mean... That's supposed to be a relaxing thing. 
You're not supposed to act like you're, you're, you're trying to get the kinks out of your back first thing in the morning. Those lights are so awesome. I'd absolutely love to have those as bookcases. <laughs> yep, yep, no doubt. She will love spending time here. I would love spending time here. No, no lie. I mean, except for the cold. May not be too thrilled with the freezing cold conditions. That would be my only downside here. Can we climb that? Probably not. But I have to go look now. Nope, we can't. That noisy Norn is back. Would someone shut him up? <clears throat> oh, you must be the noisy Norn. Too much has been forgotten. I can't believe that blessed Norn is back. He's so disruptive. What Norn? That reader, reader fellow, he comes around every now and then, hollers for a challenge. Poor Lout's probably had one too many drinks. Challenge? Yeah, and he'll continue to shout for a challenger until someone agrees to fight him. I do it myself, but he throttled me. I seen him take on five minutes once. I have to see how tough he really is. Be careful, he's a big fellow. And if he, his bite is as bad as his bark, he could be trouble. Defeat Rock... Radar Rock Crusher. I have no idea what I just got myself into. <laughs> I have no clue. I guess he must be way down there somewhere. Can I pet you? We'll pet you. I wanted to pet the. I want to pet the silver hounds. I want to pet the bunny. Oh, the bunny's cute. I actually want to pet the moas too. I know you can't really interact with the animals, but I guess I can't say anything. You can't really interact with most of the animals in Lotro either. New event nearby. Do none of you bookworms have the stones to challenge me? Maybe if we ignore him, he'll go away. Yeah, because that worked so well last time. So are you a hero challenge or what? I have no clue. you come to challenge me? Why would I want to challenge you? Because I am Reed or Rock Crusher, the mightiest Norn in Alteria. If you're not up to the challenge, leave me. I don't waste my time on weakling. I'm not weakling. One of us is going to get hurt. And it's not going to be me. Alright. <laughs> Big burly guy. Hi. Didn't I talk to you already? I think I did. Over in Bouldermouth Vale, heard her lie has been having trouble maintaining her dolly. Yep, that's the one I talked to earlier. Alright. <laughs> now that we've done all that, we're supposed to be looking for something. Which is out here. Well, on the way there, we should probably get this next waypoint. Oh, is it a 
expecting all of this. Not that I mind. A bookworm, huh? I'm smart. See, I got lots of papers filled up with squiggles. This sounds like I'm an impressive collection. <laughs> Bunch of papers. Really? Really? Oh, come on, guys. So, there's another event over here. And it's right where I need to go. And I think this is the only path to get where I need to go. All right. I guess we are stopping. We'll go back. At least find a fire because it is freezing cold here. And she doesn't really like it. Next time. Oh, next time we'll go explore and look for some dwarven dwarven tomb. Yes, it actually exists. Until then. Bye for now. Thank you.